Welcome to Legacy Explorers, where we explore the ancient world. Our videos delve into world mythology, civilization, and ancient cultures, we'll take you on an adventure through time and space. In the grand tapestry of Greek mythology, Zeus, the formidable king of the gods, stands as a central figure whose exploits extend far beyond his thunderous dominion. Renowned for his supreme power, Zeus is equally notorious for his amorous escapades, weaving a complex web of affairs that entangle mortals, goddesses, nymphs, and mythical entities alike. This video embarks on a detailed exploration of Zeus's affairs, delving into the myths and stories that have immortalized the Divine King's romantic dalliances. Number 1. Mortal Affairs Zeus's proclivity for mortal women is a recurring motif in Greek mythology, serving as the catalyst for numerous epic tales. Let's explore some of Zeus's mortal affairs. Alcmena and the birth of Heracles, Zeus's affair with Alcmena, a mortal woman, is marked by divine cunning. Disguised as her husband, Amphitryon, Zeus approached Alcmena, leading to the birth of the mighty Heracles. Hera, always watchful of Zeus's escapades, sought to undermine Heracles at every turn, instigating the famous twelve labors that would come to define the hero's legacy. This affair not only showcases Zeus's prowess in deception but also sets the stage for the heroic exploits of Heracles. Danae and the Golden Shower The tale of Danae involves Zeus's transformation into a golden shower to access her chamber. This unconventional union resulted in the birth of Perseus, a hero destined for greatness. Danae and Perseus faced numerous trials, including the infamous encounter with the Gorgon Medusa. Zeus's creative approach to romantic pursuits underscores the mythical ingenuity woven into these narratives. Semele and the birth of Dionysus, Semele, a mortal princess, became the object of Zeus's affections. In a tragic turn of events, Hera, discovering Zeus's involvement, disguised herself as Semele's nurse and convinced her to request Zeus to reveal himself in his true divine form. Unable to deny her request, Zeus appeared in all his glory, and the mortal Semele perished in the ensuing brilliance. However, Zeus rescued the unborn child, Dionysus, sewing him into his thigh until the god was ready to be born. This story adds a layer of tragedy to Zeus's mortal affairs, emphasizing the consequences of divine passion. Europa and the White Bull Zeus's pursuit of Europa, a Phoenician princess, showcases his ability to shape-shift into a majestic white bull. In this guise, Zeus seduced Europa and carried her away to the island of Crete. Their union resulted in the birth of Minos, a significant figure in Greek mythology. The story blends elements of divine deception, transformation, and the establishment of influential bloodlines. Leda and the Swan Redux, the tale of Leda and the Swan, where Zeus approached Leda in the guise of a swan, adds complexity to the relationships between mortals and immortals. The resulting births of Castor and Pollux, sons of Tyndareus, and Helen and Clytemnestra, fathered by Zeus, lay the groundwork for epic narratives, including the Trojan War. The intertwining of mortal and divine fates becomes a recurring theme in Greek mythology. Number 2. Divine Consorts Zeus's matrimonial ties to Hera did not preclude his dalliances with other goddesses. Let's delve deeper into Zeus's affairs with divine consorts. Demeter and the birth of Persephone, Zeus's union with Demeter, the goddess of agriculture, resulted in the birth of Persephone, a central figure in Greek mythology. However, this divine affair takes a dark turn when Hades, the god of the underworld, abducts Persephone. The ensuing search and negotiation between Demeter and Hades contribute to the explanation of the changing seasons. The myth highlights the intricate relationships within the pantheon and the delicate balance of power among the gods. Leto and the twin deities, Zeus's liaison with Leto, a Tetanus, resulted in the birth of Apollo and Artemis, twin deities of considerable influence. The myth surrounding Leto's labor on the island of Delos, where she sought refuge from Hera's relentless jealousy, reflects the challenges faced by divine consorts. Despite Hera's efforts to prevent Leto from finding a place to give birth, Apollo and Artemis emerged as powerful Olympian deities associated with the sun and moon. 
This narrative underscores the resilience of divine consorts against the backdrop of Hera's opposition. Maya and the birth of Hermes, Zeus's affair with the Pleiad Maya led to the birth of Hermes, the messenger of the gods and the trickster figure in Greek mythology. Hermes displayed cunning and wit from an early age, attributes perhaps inherited from his divine parentage. The myth of Hermes's birth showcases Zeus's ability to forge alliances with various divine beings and highlights the diverse roles played by the offspring of such unions. Themis and the Fates Zeus's union with Themis, one of the Titans, resulted in the birth of the three Moirai or Fates, Clotho, Lachesis, and Atropus. These entities played a crucial role in determining the destinies of both gods and mortals. The story of the Fates illustrates Zeus's connections with primordial forces and the intricate tapestry of fate woven by these powerful beings. It also underscores Zeus's role in shaping the cosmic order. Number 3. Nymphs and Other Entities Beyond mortals and goddesses, Zeus's romantic interests extended to nymphs and various mythical entities. Among these are Io, the transformed priestess. One of Zeus's more intricate affairs involved the mortal priestess Io. As a token of his affection, Zeus transformed Io into a beautiful heifer to protect her from the wrath of Hera. However, Hera, ever perceptive, was not fooled for long. In her relentless pursuit, Hera sent the hundred-eyed giant Argus to watch over Io. Zeus, determined to reunite with Io, commissioned the god Hermes to lull Argus to sleep and free Io. Despite these efforts, Hera's vengeance persisted, and Io wandered the earth until she was eventually restored to human form, bearing Zeus a son named Epiphus. Callisto, the nymph and bear, Zeus's romantic involvement with the nymph Callisto led to both tragedy and celestial transformation. Callisto, a companion of the goddess Artemis, caught the eye of Zeus. Hera, discovering the affair, transformed Callisto into a bear as punishment. In this form, Callisto roamed the wilderness until her son Arcus, fathered by Zeus, nearly killed her while hunting. To prevent further tragedy, Zeus intervened, transforming Callisto and Arcus into constellations, Ursa Major and Ursa Minor, ensuring their eternal place in the night sky. The tales of Zeus's affairs contribute significantly to the multifaceted narrative of Greek mythology, unraveling the intricate relationships between gods and mortals, gods and goddesses, and the consequences of divine actions. These myths, laden with symbolism and moral complexity, explore themes of power, jealousy, and the unpredictable nature of the divine realm. The enduring legacy of Zeus's affairs resides not only in the fantastical stories themselves but also in the lasting impact they have had on art, literature, and cultural narratives. As we traverse the vast landscape of Greek mythology, the amorous escapades of Zeus stand as a testament to the timeless allure and enduring fascination of these age-old tales. Do not forget to like, share and subscribe.